and we can make can we make a sandwich out of this? I'm not really aiming to make a sandwich. I'm mostly making aiming to make a uh, energy drink. Shake. There we go. You fucking make food and you feel like shit about it. It's like Jesus. Lady. I guess vomit is the sound of love these days. And throw that shit away. Don't need it ever again. I don't even want it to be in my face. I just want it to fucking die a horrible death. Uh, now I gotta make a sandwich. Wow. How stereotypical of a female. She's in. A, she's embracing her inner man, and now she's making a sandwich. I mean, what is this shit? So let's make a fucking. Let's make a sandwich beyond any sandwich you've ever seen. Turkey, turkey sandwich up in here. Turkey and cheese. Turk and cheese. That sounds not really that appealing, in all honesty. Food. Food. Make sandwich or make sandwich. I'm gonna make a sandwich. Patrizo. I need you. There you are. Martina, don't steal Isabella's husband. Give food to Patrizo. Here you go, Patrizo. I made you a fucking turkey ass sandwich right here. My t patent turkey ass sandwich. Hope you enjoy it. Yeah. I know, I'm awesome. What is this guy's problem with soda? It's like the 15th time that's popped up. Tell you what. Oh my god, airplanes in the night sky. What is everyone's infatuation with airplanes? And once again, no soda. That's all they can talk about. This is all that I know. I just hate soda. It's just some bullshit, man. This is some bullshit. Haven't you been listening, Martina? He hates soda. He has to explain it again to you, you stupid bitch. Man, this is so tedious. It's the only way you can become friends with him, though. Because if you do anything else, he just hates you. And once again, you're talking about soda. What is wrong with you? Isabella, wouldn't you like to become friends with your husband again? Let's do it. Wake his ass up. Make him love you. Rekindle that relationship. Marriage. God damn it with your job. Man, I don't even give a shit about your job, Isabella. It's time for you to rekindle your love with your former. Yeah. Get back here. I can't keep up through all the lag, guy. You have to slow down whenever I lag. Wow, I'm almost I'm almost there with Patrizo. Let's fucking go then. Talk, just talk, just talk it out, just talk it out. You fucking bitch. Are you serious? All you need to do is not be a complete fucking cunt and you're in love with him again. And guess what happens? You act like a moron, so now you have to balance a vacuum on your nose. Let this be a lesson to you. You just need to talk to someone. Don't balance a vacuum on your nose. Buy an ingredient source. I don't fucking want to. Ugh. And now she's going to go to work. Thank you. Another tree for your troubles. You're welcome, groundskeeper. Eastwood. Yeah, make an espresso while that's broken. Let me know how that turns out for you, huh? Let me know how this turns out. Let me know how that turns out. Come on. Come on, show me the money. Show me the money. Didn't work out for you really that well, did it? Huh? Yeah, it's fucking right. And for some reason, I recovered some energy. Well, I guess it was a energy drink. Okay, cool. Oh my god, really? Wow. Wow. Oh, this shit. This shit. 
I'm getting really fucking sick and tired of all these fucking... You know what? No. No. Don't even call the fire department. Don't even call the fire department. I'm done dealing with this shit. Throw a party. I'm throwing a fucking party. A fucking fire party. We're all having fun over here, aren't we? It's a good fucking time, isn't it? We're gonna throw a fucking party with this fucking bullshit. Time to put on my dancing shoes. Oh, you might want to do a little bit more dancing practice before you get over here because... Today's special is Disco Inferno. Burn, baby, burn. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno! Guys, calm down. There's nothing wrong here. Jeez, you're making such a big deal out of nothing. JK Rowling sure knows what the fuck she's doing. Man, I tell you what. Even though they both disagreed, they're still five friends. Yo! Yeah. Because that's how the real world works. Woo. Those of you who are younger may want to look away. This is um, not particularly the, uh, the most appropriate thing that you should be watching in the uh, in, uh, coming times here. Uh, yeah. Timmy, how's it going? How's it feel to share a bed with another man? <laughs> oh, this is so wrong. Ah. Oh, no. Don't do it. Oh, no. Oh, God. Listen to the controller go. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, my God. That's the controller. Oh, that's so wrong. Yes. It's just not a it's just not a kamikaze games playthrough until gay sex. Oh, it's just never complete until the gay sex comes in. And the fucking poltergeist blankets too. Apparently. That was also terrifying. Oh my god. The carpool has arrived for who? Who the hell's going now? Is this a Who the hell's going to work? Where, who, the, what? Hello? Who's, who, who here's going to work? Jesus. Oh my god, what is happening? Dear. It looks like fucking God himself has decided to uh, materialize himself as this drink. Look at that. Just 4th of July sparkler effect going on. My god, that's fucking insane. Now it's gone forever. Amazing. All right, well. Someone broke the fucking sink again, because... Complete fucking moron. And that's what happens when you, whenever you drink the god particle. Your skills go up. Three. And then go back down once you're, like, done doing shit. It helps. I think you can actually get promoted doing that, but I'm not sure. Because usually I need friends to get promoted. And drinking God Particle does not give you a... Does not give you friends, unfortunately. Although, doing like the love potion can make you love anyone. And then you can make out with them. And that'll get you like seven friendship points. So you can waste all your money on food. And So let's make something special. Let's make lobster. Probably gonna want to use the food processor for this. Make soup, make soup, make soup, prep soup. There we go. Feeling it right now, man. A love potion right there. 110 hunger. Golly. So we got some aspiration points. Now, we got ourselves a big bowl of soup. Alright, y'all. Got us some soup. Give food to Patrizzo. Alright, where the fuck is Patrizzo? Is he at work right now? He might be at work. Might have to, like, save that until later and just hand him a snack or something. I don't know. Patrizzo, Patrizzo. Where in the world is Patrizzo? Patrizzo, there you are. Give food to Pat... No, that's Martina. Shit. No. It's Martina. Look like Patrizzo from... There you are! Standing in the rain. Patrizzo, get over here. Here I am, just a drowning in the rain. 
With a ticket for a runaway train. And there you go. A tearful reunion. We've unlocked. This stage is now complete as we stand in the rain and I hand Patrick out some soup and he just sets it down in the middle of the rain. And okay. So this is what this is what you do after I toil over a hot stove making you soup. You just leave it set out in the rain. That's depressing. What a sad day. After a long day at work. I make you all this fucking soup and you just set it down outside in the rain. Patrizo. What the fuck is wrong with you? Eat the rest of it. See? Ozzy appreciates my cooking. See, at least someone appreciates my cooking, Patrizo, you fucking whore. I tell you what. Should have made Patrizo have sex with Dawn. That's what I should have done. <laughs>